at the end of year eight when I was finishing my at my old school, we were looking around at schools where I could mix tennis and academics to a high level and Millfield stood out as that the place I could, could do that. The tennis coaches were very helpful when we were talking about that and yeah, the school just seemed very appealing in that. Yes, we came came my last year, my old school. Yeah, the facilities are amazing, so yeah, we I really wanted to come here. Yeah, I was, I was very happy. I was, at, I was actually at a tennis tournament at the time, so it helped uh, for that day of matches. So I was just yeah over the moon really. Well, yeah, I'm doing I'm doing four A levels: maths, further maths, chemistry, and physics. But yeah, I'm still trying to do tennis to a high level as well. But um, I've just started that, and it's going well so far. I compete nationally. I had nationals. I got to the final nationals this year, doubles. Um, but I'm also playing. ITS, which is the junior international circuit. I'm currently around 900 in the world, but I've still got three more years to go. So hopefully by the end, that could end up with me playing junior Wimbledon. That's the aim. Three days a week, I have I have tennis or gym in the morning, and then I'll have either four to five lessons in a day. So three in the morning. I always have something at lunchtime, tennis or in the gym and then another two lessons in the afternoon and then tennis after school and then into homework so yeah it's very full on but it's manageable um, so America, American unis the balance of tennis and academics there is, is really exciting uh, I've seen a lot of videos and seen some talks and what, what goes on over there so that's what strikes me is what I want to do well there are loads of, there are loads of talks and stuff about studying in America, tennis, all loads of players in the last few years have gone to America so all the coaches have experience of what's going on over there. I still talk to some of those guys that went off a few years ago and how they're getting on over there so I think I get a pretty good picture of what's going to be like over there. Uh, just to be open, it does, it does get hard sometimes if you're balancing high academic level and high sport level, you're going to have a lot on your plate but if you're ready to accept that the teachers and all the coaches are very accepting of what that's going to be like. So if you're open, you can manage your time great and there's no reason why you can't do both at a very high level.